Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Huge billboard in Maryland has libs panicking over what's coming after attacking Trump. It's a promise. For the last year and a half that Trump has been in office, the liberal left has been working angles to try to impeach him. Every week the Mueller investigation takes a new sweeping turn. This investigation started because Democrats couldn't believe that Trump was elected, so somehow Russia must have been involved. Over the last six months, we have learned that the evidence that brought on special counselor Robert Mueller was paid for by the DNC and the Clinton Election Committee. It was lied about at the highest levels of the FBI and DOJ under the Obama administration. There is clearly no evidence of Russian collusion, yet the investigation into President Trump continues. GOP lawmakers have called many times for an end to the investigation, and for Jeff Sessions to define the scope of Mueller's powers. The DOJ has remained defiant. Across the country, extreme right-wing conservatives are stirring. They think that Trump will eventually be up for impeachment and that has them talking. In a small town in Virginia, a billboard has popped up that has liberals calling the sheriff. Local 12 writes, Huntingtown, Maryland, WJLA, dash there is a lot to read these days when you drive down Solomon's Island Road in Calvert County. Politicians looking for votes, businesses looking for customers, and then one sign at Bowie Shop Road that is turning a lot of heads. Hey liberals, it reads. Better get your guns if you try to impeach President Trump. From all of your deplorables in Calvert County. I love the billboard, Michelle Rinker said. We're conservative and there's a lot of corruption that's happened in this country and I don't think it's threatening. I'm a Republican but I think it's a little offensive, Kelly Mozzella said. I think you can persuade people on the topics and not insult them. One woman who didn't want to be shown on camera said her young son is frightened by it. I hate that billboard, she said. I think it's very threatening. I don't like it at all. It's been up for a couple weeks, and all over social media. It has been viewed and commented on an anti-Trump Facebook page tens of thousands of times, but a number for the owner posted on the sign goes unanswered. Now, the Calvert County Sheriff's Office has been flooded with phone calls, some people complaining about the sign and others complaining about the complaints about the sign. The sheriff has now spoken to the owner, who has agreed when he comes back from out of town to at least change it. Certainly, his message has been sent. If you attempt to take down a good president, there's going to be a problem. Rinker said. These types of warnings have been going on now for quite a while. In fact, last August former Navy SEAL Craig Sawyer said something quite similar to what the folks in Calvert County said. Conservative firing line quotes him, I'm hearing serious rumblings of a hostile, illegal coup against our democratically elected president by seditious, deep state subversives funded by Soros and other globalists. Very disturbing, he wrote, adding. Patriots, this would be nothing less than an act of war against the American people. It would be the removal of our boldest defender and last possibility of maintaining our protective constitution. Under the boot of globalists, life as we know it, would immediately decline to the model that suits the globalist interest, Marxist slash socialist slash communist. They get complete control, you get zero. Freedom, gone. Liberty, gone. This agenda is evil and simply cannot be allowed, at any cost. Like all military, law enforcement and government officials, I took an oath to defend our Constitution against all enemies, foreign and domestic. By abandoning the rule of law and conducting a coup against the President and policies we the people elected, they have made themselves enemies of the United States. After observing that all patriots, regardless of position, have a duty to protect the Constitution, Sawyer minced no words detailing what he believes would happen to those involved in Trump's removal and he explained why. Anti-American subversives involved in any way in an unconstitutional coup against our president will be run down and executed immediately by the world's most supreme warriors. There will be nowhere to run to, nowhere to hide, no mercy, no sense of humor. Harsh examples will be made. My prediction is it will be a gruesome massacre. Why? Because one side in this conflict has 8 trillion bullets and the other side doesn't know which bathroom to use. And, he added, it won't take very long. It will likely only take a few hours. Lessons will be learned. History will take note. Order restored. While these examples are extreme, we have watched this witch hunt go on now for the president's entire term in office. Where will it end? It's time for Jeff Sessions to resign or be fired. To allow this investigation to go on like this with no boundaries to the scope of the investigation is outrageous. President Trump isn't bothered by the chaos, the harder the storm blows the more he accomplishes. 
let's hope for our country that he is able to continue on for two terms. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.